Hello again. Here's um, game number two. This one is called Kin's Game. And again, it's another memory game to get your brains working really hard. Now, I'm going to start off with four things. Um, but you can make the, um, have more and more things as you make it more and more difficult. Okay, so we've got four things. I've got, I've got a pen. I've got a little leopard toy. I've got a key. And I've got a green measuring spoon. I've got one, two, three, Four things for you to remember. The pen, the leopard, the keys and the spoon. Now I'm going to cover them up with a tea towel. Here we go. And I'm going to take one of those things away and see if you can remember what should be there and now what's gone. Now then, can you see what we've got? We've got the pen and the leopard and the spoon what was it that was here can you remember have a little you can pause the video and have a think about it and then we'll have a look are we ready it was the it was the keys well done if you got that right should we have another go now i'm going to make it a little bit more difficult we've got a nice order here a pen a leopard the keys and the spoon but this time I'm going to mix the items up before I take the, the cloth away. Makes it a little bit more tricky. Are you ready? So remember there's four things. And I'm going to put that underneath, put those underneath. I'm going to take one of the things away. I'm going to move the items around. And now see. So I've got the keys still there. The spoon is still there and the pen is still there. So which one of these things, which one has gone? Have a, you can pause the video and have a think about it until you're ready. And then we'll find out until you're ready. It was the leopard toy. Well done, if you got that right. Okay, now we can make it, you can make it more difficult by taking two things away and trying to remember those two things or you can make it even more difficult by adding more things so I'm going to try an even harder one now so we've got our leopard toy our key our measuring scoop our pen and now I'm going to add this cube toy it's called a Rubik's cube and add that on too so now we've got five things to remember We've got the leopard toy, the key, the measuring spoon, the pen, and the cube toy. So we've got five things in that order. The leopard, the key, the spoon, the pen, and the cube toy. Are you ready? I'm going to put the blanket over the top, the tea towel over the top. I'm going to take one of those things and... Can you remember what it is? So we've got the leopard toy, the key, the pen and the cube toy. There's a space in the middle. What was there? Can you remember? Pause the video and have a little think if you need to. I'm going to show you what it is. Are you ready? It was the... The spoon, the measuring scoop. Well done everyone if you got that right. Now we're going to try these five things again. But this time I'm going to mix it up to make it a little bit more difficult like I did last time. Are you ready? So I'm going to cover up the items. I'm going to take one away and I'm going to mix all the things up. Are you ready? So now there were five things. Now there's only one, two, three, four things. So one's gone. We've still got the pen, we've still got the keys, we've still got the scoop, we've still got the leopard toy. So what's, what's gone? What's, what's missing? Have a little think 
pause the video if you want to have a, a longer think and then we'll have a look in a second are we ready it was the the cube toy well done well done now you can try this at home and challenge your family um, you can have start with just a few things maybe three or four things and then add one more as you go you could even try and trick them by taking two things or maybe even three things or maybe even nothing at all okay you have a go at that have fun and we'll see you very soon bye bye